You know, I grew up with sight. Everything came to me really easily. I was just, I'm not bragging, but I was just good at everything I did. When I started losing my sight, it was really hard because I had to work extra hard at everything and nothing just came to me anymore. Kind of taught me a lesson. <laughs> I feel confident with her because first time she, she came here the other night, her attitude was, you know, I haven't worked out for a long time. It, it's hard, but she, she was injured. But since then, I tell you, she's really changed. She was like, you know, I think I'm almost there. I thought we gotta get rid of it almost. <laughs> I apologize about this in advance. Wow, see? He's big, he's a big kid. I was working on a throw that I'm not very good at. It's called Tayatoshi. It's basically an upper body hand wheel, but you use your feet in it as well and I'm not getting the feet down right. Still not getting that leg. It's getting a little frustrating that I was trying it so many times and couldn't get it just how I wanted it or just right. <sighs> My part's gonna be aggravating, okay. <sighs> it's not. <laughs> you know, one of the things you get, when you get your basic technique about how to learn it, then a lot of people, you, all you do is change it to your style. I'll try, it's just like the last thing I'll focus on when I throw, you know? Right away, right away. Yeah. Go ahead. I don't... Wait. Coach, I'm not, like, questioning. I'm just curious. Why do you want me to do Tai Toshi so much? Oh, I want you to get the, the simple throws. Ochi, Tai Toshi, Ippon Senagi. It has been a very difficult time, especially the last nine months with all the concussion stuff. Once you get to a certain level, you know how good you are, you know what you're capable of, and when you don't reach the potential that you know you have, that's my biggest fear. You're moving really stiff. Here, here, here. This hand stays down, and then you're kind of like here. It's kind of lazy. I'm tired, that's why. <laughs> One more to each side. I get it. You gotta keep tracking her way, where she's at. We wanna make sure she's in good shape all around, physically and mentally. Was that that one good? I felt it. I felt it too. <laughs> you know, when I was doing judo before, I could just go nonstop and do everything plus some. And so having to um, stop and regroup all the time is pretty frustrating. The next thing we're going to do is you be throwing both our Tim and Jennifer. Just throw for throw. You can throw one place, grab one person, do a throw, move it around, grab the other person, throw in different directions. That's enough. No, forward. And away. And away. Sorry. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Follow it, yeah, it's away. Okay, my day. <sighs> Those are slubby. No, that's okay. Even if you're tired, you still gotta go in and try, okay? You okay? Yeah. I'm just getting like overheated for some reason. Yeah, take it back for a second. Take your paper towel. Rub her face. I'm going to take my gi off for a second. Yeah. I'm still getting the effects of the post concussive syndrome. Yeah. Yeah. When I work out and stuff, a lot of things trigger those yeah, you, symptoms. Yeah, get, uh, get yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, go, go. Yeah, yeah. One step down. That's it. And you said you just need one. What's going on? I don't know what. Your head? Yeah, I was like overheating really bad and my head is like... Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Don't talk. Close your Training for this and going into it is just... I guess you, the losing is a fear. 
before I knew, okay, you can do this, you can actually win this, and now it's not, <laughs> I'm not confident. Perfect freaking timing. It's okay. You did well. It was tough. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, but it felt terrible. Just remember where you're coming from, okay? I don't know why I put so much pressure on myself, but I, I do. <sighs> yeah, that's okay. It's part of the training, you know. It gets sometimes it gets tough. Just get trying to work to it. Just take your break. Johnny, you'll be fine. I don't get to see my family as much as I should. I spend more time with other people's kids. It's, it's never easy. But if, you, if you're gonna do something 100%, that's what you have to do. Okay. <sighs> okay. Yeah. When stuff happens, I put it all on myself. You know, it's not the coach's fault for letting me go back too soon or sports med's fault for going back too soon. It's, it's always my fault. Being an athlete, I chose to take that risk. Having to work your way back to where you were before just gets frustrating. Especially when it's because of like something beyond your control. When you wanna do it, but you just can't. I kind of knew something was going on when she called. It was up to her. It, it was definitely up to her. 